Okay, guys, I did it. I managed to straighten up my house to an acceptable degree for Christmas, which we're celebrating today, but I'm sick. So, here's where we're at. There is the doggy bed with he's got his own little pillow. And I wanted to bring something up because I talked about that towel last time and I said it was supposed to snow and Dennis makes me put it there so I can wipe or Dennis throws it there so that I can wipe his feet when it snows. I meant the dog's feet. I I love Dennis, but I don't wipe his feet when he comes home from work. I just not that kind of wife. Uh the gifts are wrapped under the tree and there's the tree. I don't know if I showed you that that's what I ended up doing with the little truck and tree I got at the thrift store. Um, Dennis's cousin got us that, which the kids will all dig into. I just have one thing on the chest, one decorative piece, and, and this candle. I burned it all day yesterday. It didn't make a dent. This is amazing. This is This is beautiful, and it smells so good. And I have my uh, Christmas pillows from Wish for two dollars. Oh my gosh! And I just I have throw pillows, and all I did was unzipped it and put one of my own throw pillows in it. And the other one is there. Oh hi, are you decoration? You're my favorite decoration, and you pulled a string off my pillow. <laughs> so I just have a blanket draped there with a couple of pillows, and then. I am set up for sick day, yes. Uh, I have a bowl with med, a, ba a little basket with medicine and a little hospital tray. I, the stockings are all hung by the fireplace. And there's two of the little kids' chairs. And my kitchen table is finally visible. <laughs> and the candles are lit. And this is, remember those things that I got? I don't know if they came from June or what, but yeah, we haven't set the table yet because we're going to do snacks first. But I actually did get the dishes clean, and uh, I've got our holiday glasses out, and my snowman cookie jar, and my, uh, it doesn't look like such a mess now, my cocoa bar. And the kids were here yesterday to paint some crafts they made for their parents. So, that's cool. And Perhaps then, the if I follow the path, this is even going to be better because this orange extension cord's a pain, though. But you can actually see my desk now <laughs> where I'm working. And I know already for Christmas that I got two new lights. So, I have a big light for here and a big light for there, one of the square lights. Because if you've noticed, my lights have been turning um, yellow. I don't know what's going on with that. I've gone through three lights on my ring light. And there's my wall of love back there from all of you. And I've got more, y'all. I got, I got more to open over here. Look at all this. Oh, my goodness. Look. More cards. You guys are so precious. So I can't wait to get those up on the wall. And I haven't checked today's smell to see if there's anything else. But that's awesome. And I have asked for an extension on my reviews because I don't feel well. And, oh, didn't need to see that mess. These are gifts that I'm taking over to my mom uh, on actually the 25th, which is Christmas. But, you know what? It's not perfect. It's definitely not a magazine, but it is what it is. Um, and I'm, I'm happy enough. I'm going to relax and enjoy the holidays with my family. Somebody asked about my sectional. Where did I get it? Um, and what was it? It's a Bernhardt. And I could never afford a Bernhardt sectional. They're very expensive, and this is a custom-made one. So, um... I knew I needed a sectional, but I didn't want a really bulky one like the one I had. So I just kept my eye open and I was watching Craigslist and we have this in the city. Um, there's a place called the Plaza, which is where the really wealthy people live in lofts. And there was an artist in a loft there who this was less than a year old and she had it for sale for $1,500 and um, you know, I looked it up. I looked up Bernhardt and I, 
for a custom one, they were between seven and eight thousand dollars, and I was like, oh, I can't afford that. But for fifteen hundred dollars, I could. And then she came down to a thousand on it. So yeah, I grabbed it, and this is what my how my decor is right now. But we're working on some things like we want to get rid of these beams in the ceiling, and raise the ceiling higher, and uh, I want to go with some farmhouse decor. So we'll see how that goes. Um, I can't do anything right now though. I just I really feel bad, so I'm gonna recline in the chair and just watch everybody enjoy the day. I. I, my lungs hurt really bad. I'm I'm sick, y'all. I'm sick. I've been r running fevers at night, really bad, and I'm really struggling for breath. Um, I will go to the hospital if it gets worse. Uh, <coughs> I'm, I'm not I'm not coughing up much. Um, my tonsil was super swollen, but that kind of went down. But it comes back again. It's weird. But my chest hurts really bad. So hopefully that will go away. I hope you all have a wonderful Christmas. And I hope I hope to be able to get those cards opened and film that and, and relax. But until then, Merry Christmas, you guys. I love you so much. Be blessed. And um, just thank you for being there. God bless you.